So I want to show how easy it is to hook in LangChain and OpenAI or GenAI into Salesforce. So I'm going to go ahead and demo this Streamlit application in which I connect into my free Salesforce account and I have three contacts in there. And from here, I can go ahead and then contact. And for example, I have um, owner of the Timberwolves, Minnesota Vikings and Minnesota Twins. I'll pick the owner of the Minnesota Vikings and I'm going to click generate insights. And here what I'm doing as I pull the from Salesforce across, I'm going to get an AI generated insights about the company and some of the recent news that have happened and some of the risk factors. Then down below, if I want to contact them, I can go ahead and pick a style of script. Let's say I want to build a relationship and this length of call I want to prepare for on the sales script, I'm gonna go ahead and click that. Well, that shows exactly the type of script I wanna have, how effective AI thinks it's going to be, what my opening statement, the value, discovery questions and objections and how to handle each of those, along with the closing statement and what my call to action should be to that contact. Um, and then I wanna show also the account analysis and I haven't built this entire thing out yet, but I can pick again, any of my contacts. I'm gonna pick the Minnesota Twins this time and I'm gonna say generate account analysis. So you're gonna get information about the growth of the company where Gen AI thinks it's going to be and I have a Taverly search agent. So it's not just stale data that sits within um, the large language model, but it's using relevant uh, market information from Taverly search engine. Talks about some of their competitors. Well, it's the Chicago White Sox and the Tigers, expansion opportunities, retail, um, and that sort of stuff. So how this was all made possible so simply with LangChain is I stumbled upon this um, LangChain tool uh, that was created by develop another developer uh, to connect into Salesforce. Um, all you need to do is to go to your Salesforce account. Um, again, I got a free one set up and export. You have four different variables, your username, password, token, and your domain, which I use just login. And then it even gives you some examples on how to make certain sorts of calls. Um, from there, I was able to take that and build upon the Streamlit Python code all below um, in the GitHub repo. Thank you. Have a great day.